Hi, in this video, we're going to resize a photo on the Mac without installing any software. We're just using the Mac Previewer. Uh, today, I'm using the Big Sur version of Mac OS operating system. And if you checked out my last video on how to do this in Windows 10, I used this exact same photo. So we're gonna do pretty much the same thing, but on the Mac. I found the best way to start this processor is in the finder, right click on the file name and choose duplicate. Now open the version of our file with the file name ending in copy and choose tools, then adjust size. It's a little bit more technical than Windows, but we have basically the same options. We can do custom, or we can do a smaller version, a medium, and a large. So I'm gonna choose this mid-range 1024 here. And I would have shot this photo on my camera phone, which is a Pixel 5 or Pixel 2 XL. You can see the file size is significantly smaller, 289 kilobytes, as opposed to our original 2.7 megabytes. Click OK. Now don't worry about the size of the picture here, uh, but this is the reason why I wanted you to duplicate the file before resizing it. I just found I was overwriting photos a lot uh, easier doing it any other way than this. By duplicating and going into the copied version, you aren't overwriting your original file. On the Mac here, it's a good way to show you the pixelization. I'm going to open up our original file and the copy version, you can kind of see here, there's no real difference just looking at it eye view. But if I zoom in here and go right into the windows, you can see some pixelization happening in our copied version as opposed to our original. So um, that's basically what we're doing is we're making the file size smaller so that it can appear on a website a lot quicker. Having the smallest file size that you can matching the dimensions would be the best way. So if you know how many pixels you're taking up on your website, um, it's best to measure out those pixels and resample the image to that size. If I was emailing this, I could easily give eight times more photos than uh, just having the original versions and you don't really notice any difference. Thanks again for watching my videos. If you found it helpful, please be sure to like it. And if you think this might be helpful for somebody else, be sure to share it with them. Thanks for watching. Bye.